What is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Charles here, aka the Bearded Guru. First of all, I want to thank you for taking the time to check out this website funnel template that I built for the ClickFunnels Marketplace. Um, got a lot of positive reviews from the, the community, so here you go. Um, just going to go over some go over the uh, the funnel for you or the uh, the website funnel for you so you can see what what you're uh, what you're getting your hands on. Um, this is a custom CSS pop-out nav menu that I've built. All you need to do is replace the uh, URLs. Uh, this is actually mobile responsive, so when it gets to the mobile design, it will actually drop down and collapse the menu so it's not taking so much real estate. Um, also, you've got access to my custom guru slider. This is customized slightly from the its original version to fit this particular funnel. Uh, you also have a social sab, uh, social, excuse me, a social sidebar nav menu that will float with your your viewers as they're moving through your page. You can remove whatever social site platforms that you're not using. Uh, it's just simple deleting some code and you're good to go. And just replacing your links with the the proper link for the social site. There is two spots on the home page where you can grab your users information to get them on your list either by giving them a free object or a free PDF or you know introducing them to your your offer straight from this page. Uh, the home page, the about page, the events page, the course page, videos pretty much there is a thank you page that is included with this funnel that's um, kind of set up for you all you need to do is just replace your information um, the redirect overrides on all these pages just set that that thank you page you are all there and you're good to go the nav or these these sign up menus here when you scroll down it'll actually change its uh, appearance to fit the uh, mobile browser viewer um, also as you scroll down, there's another custom element that I've added, which is the Facebook like and share box. Um, also, we have the YouTube subscribe box as well. One click, and they're, they've subscribed to you on YouTube. Um, the homepage is pretty much designed to give you kind of that WordPress feel, um, basically, so you can throw your, your throw all your information out there and you know share your stuff with the world. Um, as you scroll down into there's the second uh, sign up form on the home page and here on to the left at the, at the footer area this is actually a custom blog world that I've built so that what it will do is it will dynamically pull in the last three blog posts that you have associated with the the blog site that you include in the code now key note here you have to have an SSL certificate for this font for this to function if not the browser will block the code from coming in and it just won't display so in order to keep this blog roll po um, section here you do have to have an SSL certificate on your website or on the domain where your blog site is so that it functions properly um, latest tweets area this gives you a tweet or tweet timeline your latest three tweets will be displayed um, all of this is customizable you can show as many blog posts as you want or as many tweets as you want there's also another social nav menu that I put here down in the footer um, this is a custom design the reason the main reason why this is here is because this little floater nav bar once you once you drop down to mobile size it disappears so that it's not taking up so much real estate so when your users get to the bottom they're able to click on their uh, respective uh, social site to take them to where they need to go. Um, privacy policy terms and conditions. This is done in a text block editor. Real easy to just swap out your links. Um, so the about page. This is pretty much your about you. This includes some of the elements from the main page. Um, it also includes an exit pop that's kind of designed similar to the opt-in form on the main page. They can just fill out their information here, submit the information, and it'll take them to the thank you page. Um, the about page, the events page, the courses, and videos all have that exit pop set up. So you can remove that if you would like. Um, the events page is pretty much something to show um, maybe upcoming events that you might be hosting or webinars that you might have going down so that you can properly get your um, 
get your audience attending. Courses, this is pretty much an area where you can list any type of courses that you might offer for sale or ones that you give away for free. The videos page, this is pretty much just a page to show off any videos that you might have. Um, you can, it, it's a simple video element. You can use YouTube or Wistia, you know, wh whichever you service you, you're currently hosting your, your videos through. Um, simple change of the uh, URL and you're good to go. Um, yep, so to give you an idea what that thank you page looks like, we try to exit off here and we get access. This is going to take them here. You can throw a welcome video here. Or you can remove this element and put whatever text you need. Um, you know, and it carries on some of the, the, the social stuff here as well. So, yeah, so this funnel is very easy to personalize and, and change out what you need to change out. There is an instructional page that shows you all of the videos showing you how to set up all of these little custom elements that I've built for you inside this funnel. Um, I put a lot of love in this funnel, and I hope you enjoy it as much as I did putting it together. And so just scroll down to the bottom of this page here. You'll see the buy button. Go ahead and, and take advantage of this, this <laughs> really low price that I'm letting this go for. Uh, but I want to get I want I want to see as many users as I can uh, taking advantage of this funnel. Um, a lot of people want to have their websites on side of click funnels because just it's they're, they're sick of their WordPress sites. Um, so I tried to build this funnel to give you as much as a WordPress feel as possible, but without all the headache of having WordPress. All right. So once again, thank you for taking the time to check this out. You guys take care.